We've got some other news to share with you tonight. A Ford employee is in trouble right now with the feds, and that's after child pornography was allegedly found on his work computer, also his phone. Sean Lane joins us live with how the automaker didn't hesitate to investigate and what that decision means for the case. Sean. You're right. Federal case here. We're digging into the paperwork here. Absolutely fascinating case. And you're right. Ford jumped right in to help out. Our crime and safety expert Darnell Blackburn says that was the right thing to do. It's a great job of the Ford Motor Company to report this right away and to get law enforcement involved to investigate it. Local Ford crime and safety expert Darnell Blackburn reacting to Ford Motor Company helping put a stop to allegedly extremely troubling crimes involving a Ford employee and a company issued Ford laptop computer. Federal court documents reveal that Michigan State Police Internet Crimes Against Children Task Force got a tip that a Ford employee allegedly had child pornography on a company laptop and a company cell phone. Charged in this case is Mitchell Fisher of Commerce Township. With no hesitation, Ford immediately launched an internal investigation. The FBI says Ford was able to extract material from Fisher's computer that depicts videos of what they believe is child pornography and hand that material right over to federal investigators. Investigators raided Fisher's home, finding information that he may be traveling to Florida, and he was arrested at DTW. Like I said, this is what we want to see as law enforcement personnel. We want them to report this. If you see something, say something. Let's get back to Mitchell Fisher here now, arrested at DTW, in custody, facing two federal charges now related to child pornography. It's possessing child pornography, Kim, and also transporting child pornography. We'll stay on it. Back to you. Oh, you will. Okay, Sean, thank you.